Okay, so this is the first video in a new series I'm doing of trades that I'm going to call the paradox trade. But basically what this trade is, it's kind of just flipping the whole options theta argument on its head and just doing the exact opposite of what you would expect uh, a theta trader to do. Like, it, like it's completely counterintuitive. And but what that does is it gives us the ability to potentially make profits, super good returns with extremely little risk. And I put a couple of these trades on last week and I documented them. And I'm just gonna make a quick video here to kind of start off this series. This will be the first in a series of videos on this particular trade. And here's the first one. These are zero day trades, zero day options. And I'm trading these on the SPX right now or the ES. And basically what it's doing is creating these super, super low risk trades. For example, you can see this one here. This was done in the middle of the week last week. This trade, there's a total risk of $97. You can see it right there. And again, it's a one day trade. And at the end of the day, had we let the trade on just expire, we would have made $328, which is like a three times return. Now this is a trade that I took off midway through the day. So I didn't get the complete 339 that would have made had I just left it on. But what I did wind up taking was uh, through about through the middle of the day, I took it off for around $152 profit. So I'm just going to come back and do the math on all these later, but that's over a 100% return. And again, that was just done in a couple of hours. And the risk on it again was super, super low. The risk was 97 bucks, but there's even another component of this trade, which I've never seen anyone else do where there's a way to eliminate that risk, that $97 risk, uh, completely so that this trade is virtually a risk-free trade. Now you're not always going to make a phenomenal return. Sometimes you may break even. Sometimes you actually may lose a little, a little bit, although it would be less than this 97 bucks here. Uh, but when it pays off, it pays off like hugely, like multiple times the risk. So that was the first trade I put on. I put this on the ES midweek. Let's look at another one I did here. This is one coming up. Here's one I did on the SPX, and this was around midweek, I believe. This trade had a total risk at initiation of $40. You see it right there. And again, this is totally counterintuitive to the way that I usually teach people to trade or that I prefer to trade, which is uh, it's uh, they're, they're theta trades where we're taking uh, we're taking advantage of the probabilities of the index or the underlying remaining within a certain range. This is just kind of flips that whole thing on its head, and it's like completely counterintuitive to that. But playing around with it for several months now, I found a way to make these things really viable trades and like very short term trades that have potentially huge payouts with super, super limited risk. So, for example, if the index were to crash here, the most we would lose is 40 bucks. And if it were to skyrocket up to the top, it would be 40 bucks. But there's this area here where we can make up to like almost 20, let's say like 22 2300 bucks on a $40 risk. And again, as I talked about earlier, there's a second maneuver to this trade that can greatly reduce that $40 trade or even sometimes potentially entirely eliminate it. So if we look at the base structure of this trade, you can see there's a $40 risk in it. And this trade was closed uh, halfway through the trading day for a profit of $95, which is just roughly, that's, um, that's over a 200% return. And this is just one contract. So depending on your risk tolerance and your and your trading account size, you could just add multiple contracts to these trades and multiply these results. So then the very last one we did was a trade I did on Friday, just this last Friday. And again, this is just the base component of it. There's another component of this trade that enhances it even more and amplifies it and has the ability to reduce the risk all the way down to potentially zero. But so for this trade, this is just the base element of it. And I took this trade on Friday. This trade had a total risk of $12.50. So no matter if it crashes all the way down to, to zero, if there's a huge crash. The most I can lose is just $12.50. And the same thing on the upside. If it skyrockets way up, the most I can lose is $12.50. However, there's this area here where when we set these trades up, we set them up in a particular way using a particular set of criteria that enhances the probability of getting close or into this tent here and capturing at least some sort of a profit. And with the risk being so low on these trades, the $12.50, the profits can be enormous. They can be, they can be huge, even if you don't land inside the tent. For example, right here, you can see like right now there's a potential profit in this trade. This is like this screenshot was taken during the trading day. You can see this pink zero day line and 
at this point in time, this is about halfway through the trading day. If I would have taken the trade off at this point, and it's not even in the tent yet, I could have made $64, which is multiple, multiple returns on that initial $12.50 risk. And again, the initial setup criteria I use increases the probability of at least getting somewhere on the slope where you can make at least a 100% return all the way up to multiple times returns if it actually gets inside the tent. So for example, on this trade, at this point that this screenshot was taken, you can see I could have taken out 64 bucks which is a multiple return on the risk. However, I waited and uh, the trade was actually taken off for a total profit of $105, which is a phenomenal one day return. So again, this is just the first video that I'm going to be doing in a series of videos on this particular strategy, showing how it works, how to set it up, how to manage it, how to calculate where to actually place the trade for the highest probability of success, and also how to combine it with that second component trade that can reduce that risk even further and sometimes even completely eliminate it so it's a risk-free trade. So if you'd like to follow along with me on this trade and learn more about it and how to trade it for yourself, just make sure that you're subscribed to my YouTube channel below and also go over to my website and join me there. I'll leave a link to that in the description below. And that's it for today. I'll see you next time.